Welcome back to another vlog. This is Jo, it's Mo TV, and my name is Mojisela Hadi. And on this vlog, it's going to be a story time on this vlog because it was a very eventful day, and you guys are going to come along with me. So, on this beautiful day, Broski decided to take me out to the first ever concert I was going to be attending. No, that's not the first one. But I think, obviously, there's like, obviously, let me see, first ever concert I was going to be attending in the UK because I think I've attended a couple of them in Nigeria, in school, Babcock. You know, whether or not this artist come to your school and all that. But back to the story. So, when the tram, the story for, before, before the distance, you know, you know, you know, like, you know, go well. It's an imprint, so journey unplanned journey in fact the tales behind this whole trip and this whole event is long so at this point we're buying our tickets we couldn't get a direct bus to the vet to the location of the concert so now we had to get on this tram to get to birmingham so we got our tickets and at this point i was asking him he doesn't like to share my videos well, I think it was just half its day because <laughs> that very day because it was going for that concert. So, you know, baby girl now, I was laying. The song was, you know, giving on my skin. And that's how we got there. I think we were there for a bit. We had to wait for about a couple of hours before our boss came. So we're so hungry. We had to check this entry out. Bought burgers and I think milkshake or something. It's called Five Guys. I think that's the name of the eatery. Oh my god. I was stressed at this point. I was still I was still looking relaxed. I was still looking cool. Because I'll tell you how like with each videos, with each update on the videos, I'll be telling the story. So at this point we're just eating and still waiting. And I think we're just like the concert is there at 5 o'clock, but we're not going to get there until like maybe 7. 7 or 8? I think 7. So, we just still decided to make the trip anyways. And we're here, lounging and eating. And, obviously, I was the only person in the camera, so I was, <laughs> I was just talking. I wasn't too tired at this point. But I didn't know what was ahead of me. I didn't know what was ahead of me. So we're just here. That's the shake that we bought. So I tried to put too many fish. <laughs> At this point, I was beginning to be very tired. So I tried to go under the sun because here you hardly see the sun. So I tried to go and tan my skin. Obviously, I'm dark in complexion, but really, I just needed sun. The, f the heat of the sun on my skin. So I sat down at the city center. I sat down there. A couple of people so were there with their families and stuff. So I sat down there with my camera on my face, looking at my face, admiring it and, you know, just doing the most and talking. But I didn't know, behold, the events ahead of me. So at this point, Broski decided not to come and sit down beside me. Uh, so I said to sit by myself, just do my video. <laughs> so, yeah, I was still admiring myself in my camera. I did not know. This story is going to be in two parts. Two parts. On this very day, I became homeless. But, okay, so he came to call me and was like, babe. You look really nice. You dress well and all that. Let's take pictures. So, if you know somebody that did not learn photography and still knows how to handle camera, I'll give it to Broski. He's good. So, went to look for this location. Came to call me. Did some videos. Had it. Took some shots and all that. So, obviously, you always want the hangers. <laughs> So I just tried to do my thing. 
at this point we went back we we're on the bus I, I forgot the name of the place we we're going to somewhere around london i don't know so we're on the bus at this point you know that yes stress is already becoming inevitable my face bro don't sleep <laughs> i catch up <laughs> i caught <got> you <laughs> i caught him but so that's how we deal two hours plus on the bus program don't start we just they go let's go there so at this point we still had to continue our journey because we never ever reached venue. We have to take another underground train to where we're going to, not even the exact place, but obviously we still have to walk a couple of distance to get to the place we're going to. So I think we got around past seven. So, so let me allow you guys to listen to some of the songs. <laughs> just about they were about to finish we didn't know i think we spent about an hour plus four it wasn't worth the stress at all and that was not the beginning of my dilemma so you guys are going to have to watch out for the part two where i became homeless for the night for this trip and concert and i said never ever am i going to do this unplanned trip anymore so share like comment and subscribe and watch out for part two.